Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. You clicked on to Long Range Weather Forecast discussion for July 20th through August 3rd. We're going to look at the period for July 20th to 24th. And this is what we're forecasting on the pattern to look like. We have a strong ridge here over the southwest, um, approaches 600 dm. And we have another strong ridge over the West Atlantic that builds towards the southeast coast. We have this trough that tries to move in. It eventually does, but it'll be slow. This will bring cooler temperatures to parts of the northwest. And we have a trough here over the Mississippi Valley. Okay, um, the trough, try, uh, like I told you, it tr moves into, um, into the west later and brings some cooler air to the coastal region. The ridge in the west will cause uh, dangerous heat over the weekend. And um, in addition to the hot temperatures, low humidity, breezy conditions, and dry wind fuels will result in increased fire threat across um, portions of the north of the northwest. Monsoonal moisture will continue to work into the southwest. You can see it right here, monsoonal moisture here that'll be flowing in, and. Um, a slow moving front across the south central states, the southeast of the mid Atlantic, will cause some rain across this region. You can see it here and across to the mid Atlantic region. This will cause um, some prolonged periods of heavy rain, possibly resulting in flooding concerns. Look at the pattern for July 25th to 29th. Uh, this is what we're forecasting. We still have an MP5 flow with a strong ridge here in the west. And we have this uh, ridge that builds across the southeast. And we have a trough in the Mississippi Valley, you can see here. Trough here also across the northwest. So um, for this forecast period, I'm calling for, ooh, it changed the first time. Above normal temperatures here. And I'm calling for a to be about 10 degrees above normal. That'll be mainly across this area here. The low normal temperatures for this region and anomalies of forecast to be near two degrees below normal for precipitation. Expecting um, dry conditions here doesn't mean it'll be uh, won't get any rain, but it'll just be below normal across this area here. What are the normal conditions across this region here? And the probability of currents is 35 percent. Okay, looking at the period as we head into August, this will be from July 30th to August 3rd. Still have a quasi-zonal flow here. We still have our ridge here. And uh, if you look at some of the other models like the European Ensemble, oh, nope, but the European Ensemble brings the ridge into the southeast. Uh, I thought I saw, yep, here we go. We have a ridge here. So still a ridge. Trough ridge configuration trough here across the northwest. So for this forecast period, I am calling for above normal temperatures for much of this region. And we're calling for anomalies being near 10 degrees above normal again, mostly across this area right here. And for rainfall, expecting below normal, uh, below normal precipitation here. And for this region, probability of occurrence is near 35%. There are some indications that this area might turn wetter. Um, I was looking at some things, but for now I'm keeping it below, and I'll look at that tomorrow. And we have above normal precipitation here. Probability of occurrence is near 40%. So that's the long range weather forecast discussion for July 20th to August 3rd. Thanks for coming to Jim Mungley's World of Weather, and have a good day.